Dr. Fita, hey, you're an inspiration for thousand people around the world. What are the methods and the strategy that we can implement so that we can reach the best of um, body, soul, spirit and mind? The key word is, is conscience. It's uh, the presence and the stillness which helps us awake our conscience. People confuse conscience with mind. The mind or the brain, nothing but a tool, and should be in the hands of the spirit. Uh, you see, the body, the mind, the brain, these are reflections. What should govern human being is not a reflection, but a source. The only source is our spirit, and it only could be awakened by our conscience. So all my emphasis, especially in conferences like these, where people focus on uh, angioplasty and uh, uh, focus on uh, opening a lesion, to remind them there's a big difference between treating a disease or illness and becoming a vehicle of healing for the human being, mind, body, and soul. All, each one of us have electromagnetic field. We affect everything around us. As a matter of fact, science now becomes to realize that our conscience is the center of science. Exactly what Niels Bohr kept telling Einstein. You cannot study reality independent of the observer. So what I'm trying to convey, based on the quantum entanglement, we're all connected, we're not separated. So if you, become, if you want to become a true healer, or a vehicle of healing, you have to know how to connect your patients, not through skills only to open a lesion, but to be able to connect on deeper level, mind, body, and soul. And you always say that we should be a paradigm, uh, paradigm shift. What do you mean exactly? Pa paradigm shift means get out of the old uh, classical way of thinking of a patient and thinking of our role as physicians to treat a disease to become a vehicle of healing, mind, body, and soul. So that requires us to think in a paradigm shift, in a different way. And that's when I say paradigm shift. I cannot claim that an international medical center would be able to achieve this kind of paradigm shift. But I can tell you that this is our mission, and we are two or three steps ahead of many of other institutions. By having the uh, right way to practice medicine, but also awaken the power of the healer, uh, the, the true healer, and get us out of our old, classical, typical, uh, short-sighted, limited way of looking at of our role as uh, uh, physicians. Thank you very much for this conversation. Thank you. Thank you.